Let's have a look at how to replace URLs while running a static export. Go to Simply Static Settings General and the first box you will see is about replacing URLs. We offer three different options to replace your URLs. Relative Path, Absolute URLs and Offline Usage. If you want to host your static website with one of the static hosting providers or on your own server, we recommend either using Relative Path and using a root path to export your website or if you want to store it as a subdirectory, add the name of the subdirectory right here. Let's say block for example. If you want to use it with absolute URLs because you care about things like SEO or you already have a URL for your static website, choose absolute URLs. You can either use HTTPS, HTTP or just the path to export the URL and add the URL of your static website right here. Let's say my static dot site. This will replace all the URLs of your WordPress URL with the static site URL, making sure all the files, all the pages link to the new URL. We also offer the option called offline usage. This is only useful if you want to run a zip export and you want to open up your static website from your local computer and it's not indicated to be used on a web server environment. So please remember, if you're running a zip export to quickly check the results, choose offline usage, but don't use it for any kind of production environment. One little thing to note here is if we switch back to relative path and we quickly switch to forms and disable the forms integration, scroll down and save the settings and we're going back to settings general you will find an additional option called forced URL replacements this might be a good option if you're using an unsupported page builder or some fancy animation plugin to really make sure all the URLs are getting replaced however if you have enabled the forms integration or comments, this option will be disabled by default and the toggle is hidden because we need to make sure that we only replace the URLs needed for your static website, but not uh, URLs and paths that are required to make the forms integration work on your static website.